Hi, this is Prepper Pug doing a review, rare review of Zero Shoes with my fa favorite cameraman in the entire world and my boo, Shane Hi. Bimo Basante, and he handsome. We're going to explain the foot today. Now the foot, your arch is kind of like your leaf spring, and your other toes, they move independently. So that you can grasp things, you can bend, you can flex, you can spread your toes out, you can do all sorts of things. Lots of shoes don't allow you to do that. So we, here comes the zero shoe. It bends, it flexes, it's built really well. has a toe cap here to per keep your foot from toenails from coming in. A little bit of extra protection here. The sill has like a 5,000 mile warranty on it, which I just thought was awesome. And it's a very dense material. Uh, it's lightweight, it's very flexible, but it's also a very dense material, which means pokey things won't poke this as easily as maybe a less dense material like EVA foam. Also, on note, uh, don't have slap parties with these things, they hurt. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, I took this out the box, put it on my foot, and it was like my foot and the shoe were old friends that met again. They were all like, reunited, and it feels so good. So, if you're interested in a zero-drop shoe that's comfortable, and uh, had this for about three weeks, and any time that I know I'm going to be doing a lot of walking for any length of time, this is the shoe I go for. I uh, hope you enjoyed this review. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, leave a comment if you'd like. Thank you. Bye-bye.